What's up everybody, it's Wandering Hippie, and welcome back to the Hippie Circle. So, to continue on with the new baits, I came down here to Florida because that's where the majority of the bass fishing takes place. And I bought this frog. This is a half ounce, two alt, green, acid green frog. And... I've been fishing since 5, 5 this morning, and as you can see, every single one of my fish has been caught off this frog. This frog is overpowered, I'm telling you guys. This frog will catch every bass in Florida. I mean, I've even caught some trophies, but most of my bass are ranging from 2 to 3 pounds, which is average. And my biggest being a seven pound largey. I've been fishing for two hours. So I've been fishing since five. I've already covered, almost half covered my day. Now, you walk this frog. This, if anybody knows any of the old videos, everybody knows this is the old unique area right here. And I've been catching all my good sized fish around here. Also first thing this morning caught summer over here. But we're gonna we're just gonna fish this area right here with it and I'm gonna show you how to walk this frog. Now it's kinda like the popper. It's kinda like the popper. It's the same it's the same principle just pop it. Just kinda but you want to be a little quicker than when you pop just not much just a little quicker once in a while rest it and then start it back up again I use a stop and go walk or I'll walk it a few you know 10 12 feet and then I'll stop it and then I'll start it back up again and I've had a lot of fish hit it on the wrist But this is how you do it. You just walk it just like that. Around weeds, anything. I have yet to get this I have yet to get this lure hung up. And again, when it gets to about 25 feet, you just reel it in because you can't work it any closer than that. And I've been casting behind this weed line here. trying to get it as close to that boat as possible. Now, when they smack this thing, they smack the crap out of it. So I just missed one right there. So I stop it for a second, stop it for a second. And then there he is! There he is! He came back for it. That's something that they've just added. It used to be if you got a bite and you missed it, that was it. But now, now they'll come back for it. Looks like I got a pretty good size. Looks like I got a pretty good sized fish here. That'd make my day, I'd make my day to be recording for y'all and catch a trophy out here showing y'all how to use this old frog. Get on up here for me, son. Now yeah, look at that. Little four pound trophy right there. That's the smallest trophy you're going to get. But that's all you got to do, fellas. That's all you got to do. Just throw it out there and reel and twitch. And like I said with the popper, all I'm doing throw it back out there real quick. All I'm doing is I'm letting it sit and then I'm real tap, real tap, real jerk, real jerk, real jerk. Just nice and steady. You don't, you don't want to go too fast. You don't want to go too slow. Stop it once in a while. Keep walking it. 
just work it in just steady and persistent just like that there's one I missed him nope he come back and got it and see look at that this is a bit smaller fish no wait a minute huh I'm about to say this might be a bit smaller fish but then he started yeah it's a bit it's a smaller fish getting all excited over nothing but that's it that's how you do it that right there is how you do it this has been hippie covering the new top waters of the update I'll see y'all on the water for the stick bait or the walker whatever you want to call it take care of yourselves